Hello, this is Birjo from Germany and this will be my last video um, before Christmas and um, I'm going to introduce you my second um, design team um, journal for Susan Taylor Brown and um, that's how it goes. Uh, Susan uh, showed how she made these um, covers using um, book pages and um, I loved that idea immediately so I had to try it. So I just, there is just some advertising uh, cardboard um, inside and then um, pieces of very old um, German books as I, I think we all have plenty of book pages as we use the covers too. So, uh, and then just sewing in with this uh, sheer uh, fabric. This was one that was the only one I had at the moment. So, but I think it, it works fine. Then on the cover, I did put some uh, handmade paper piece with some inking and uh, this um, photo slide I got from Bonnie, Bonnie and Clyde from Australia. I won it a long time ago and I have been thinking what to do with this so now I came to this idea to put a dried flower in there and then laminate it. And then in the background there is some cheesecloth, so I think it works well. And the frame I just used some um, gesso and some wax. And um, as a closer I used one of my um, decoupaged buttons. And this elastic piece and the trim. And then we can go inside. So I kept this pretty um, um, plain because it's for writing. And for this one I used um, Susan's um, Paper Kit Sunset Dance and um, printable coats, coats and sea bright lined papers. On the first page I just put this as a pocket and here some um, scrapbook paper and you can see the sewing inside. Then there is one of my laminated uh, flowers and uh, then one of my crunchy envelopes, piece of sari silk, some old lace and there is another of my uh, decoupaged buttons and here I use this, I found from flea market this uh, brooch, it's, um, I think it's a poppy and as Susan's um, um, Facebook um, group is called Poppiness, so I thought it goes well to this. And inside is just, you know, this is coffee dyed. And yeah, it goes to this pocket. So the first page is um, my own paper I made from a photo during my summer holidays and I think it went well with this uh, coat in the struggle between the stone and water in time the water wins and this coat um, she has really plenty of coats where did I put them now I can show you a common sheets like this and there is really a lot and I think it was like um, 
five pages or something like that. So there is plenty, plenty to choose from and uh, she has all kind of coats in her Etsy shop. So then this is a page of the um, Sunset Dance and there I put this code All you have is now. Sometimes you know we we always want to go further or backwards but actually the only thing we have is here and now. So I'm going to use this for writing so that's why the lined paper is great. So this is the uh, first page of the uh, sea breathe, breathe, see breathe, bright <laughs> lined uh, papers. Uh, these are um, unique eco dyed papers, and she has also a kit without the lines, but this came now also with the lines. But I think it's very practice, practical, practical. So the next page here, I used some tea, um, tea papers. The you know, when you drink the tea, then I just dry this, and this is, has some um, painting on it. And here I put this quote, the bamboo that bends is stronger than the oak that resists. And then with this tea paper I made a pocket, and there I put this um, the playing card. I made a copy, I just made a place to write. This playing card I got from Austria, from my friend Angie. Thank you, Angie. I love it. And uh, then around, used some uh, eyelash trim. So this is another page of this uh, Sea Bright papers. And um, just this beautiful leaf image. And so I just made a very small collage with this uh, postage stamp, cheese cloth, and some fabric behind that. And here I just put this one coat, experience this moment to its fullest. That's what I try to do, always just be here and enjoy the moment. another page of the kit and here one kind word can warm three winter months and that's what happened to me this year because I have met so many lovely people here on YouTube and um, that will that will keep me warm for the three winter months January and February will be the coldest ones here in Germany so I'm very thank thankful for being with you all here on YouTube. That gives me the warmth. Here, this is just a paper of tea dyed paper from my stash, and I have uh, made some um, embossing stamping there. Oh, here's one of these gorgeous pages of the Sunset Dance kit. The smile you sent will always return. There's some stamping and embossing. This is just my own page. The eye never forgets what the heart has seen. Isn't that right? This is also one of my own pages. I just experiment with some, some things here. In the middle of the signature I just put this. This I also got from Angie from Wien, Austria. It has also these nice quotes. Joy is not in things, it's in us. How nice is that?
Even a sheet of paper has two sides. And here I just made a small stamping and emboss it. Take time to smell the roses. Outside, summertime, I have one yellow rose and it's smelling so wonderful and every time when I go by, I smell on it. So that's to remind me of that. These papers are really good for writing because it, it gives it um, a feeling of nature, but you can still well write on it. So here I just um, used one from 1920s page from one of my uh, flea market finds, because it has these lines, so I can put some notes there, and used a piece of a washi tape. show you what kind of book it was in. This is the book. It's a Quittungsbuch from 1919 maybe. And it has all these stamps and you know here are plenty of um, pages I can still use. Here it's just with this um, one um, ephemeral piece with this cute, cute small clip I got from Rico from Japan. This is also from Rico, and this is the last page. When you realize there is nothing lacking, the whole world belongs to you. I love that, and the Back page is back cover is also a pocket and there I just put made a few tags. This here I used some post-it stamps and some inking. And back you can write. And then I made one one flower, it's dried flower between these two plastic flaps and sewing in. And I think it goes well here. So that was my um, design team project this time and um, now it's only left to say Merry Christmas uh, to everybody here and thank you for being with me this year. I hope we continue the good um, crafting next year. And I hope that you all are spending your holidays with the people you love and uh, till the next time. Bye.